Hello, here is another problem, application of basic trigonometric ratio. Okay. The problem states, a flagpole is supported by a GUI wire that makes an angle of 60 degrees with the ground. Determine the length of the wire if it is attached 10 meters away from the base of the pole on the ground. Okay, so let's first sketch that kind of diagram. Okay, let's say this is our ground. Okay. Now, and let's make a flagpole, let's see. Let's see, this is a flagpole, okay. Now, it is supported by a wire which is 60 degrees at an angle, okay, of 60 degrees. So, let's make 60 degrees angle, this is approximately like this. Now, here, this angle is 60 degrees. length of determine the length of the wire so let's say length of the wire is l okay if it is attached to 10 meter away from the base let's say this is my base and uh, here it is attached let's say this point is a and that is 10 meters away let's say this is 10 okay so that makes it so now this is the situation and we need to find the length of the wire perfect now what should you use uh, we know adjacent side and the hypotenuse so for adjacent and hypotenuse, so katoa, cosine. Cosine is adjacent over hypotenuse. Correct. So we'll use cosine here and we say cos of 60 degrees is equal to adjacent, which is 10 over L, the hypotenuse. Correct. Remember, whenever you're doing a word problems, you have to first define your variables. Okay. I'm not defining it for you here. I'm just telling you, but you have to write. So you should say here, let the length of the wire be L, correct? And then you have to sketch your diagram and specify what is what, right? So let's write this point as F, right? Say BF represents your flag, correct? And FA is the wire attached 10 meters away. So we can write meters here for the time being away, right? And 60 degrees is my angle. So write your di diagram, make a neat diagram and define your variables, right? But my concentration here is to make you understand which trigonometric ratio we should be used when. That's the whole idea, okay? So, follow the basic procedure of solving problems. But here, concentrate on trigonometric ratios, which should be used where. So here, we know adjacent and we want to find hypotenuse. So we are relating adjacent and hypotenuse. So the ratio which is for those two is cosine. And therefore, we start with cosine 60 equals to the angle given, right? Adjacent over L. And now cross multiply and now L equals to 10 divided by cosine 60 degrees, right? It's important to write degrees. Uh, otherwise, one may not know what is 60, right? It, people will treat it as radians, okay? and calculate the answer so simple as that so it is 10 divided by cos of 60 degrees right so we say equals to 20 so we got equals to a whole number that's nice 20 right so we say length of the wire is 20 meters so you can you should write specifically answer right right answer is like of the wave wire is 20 meters okay so that is important so that completes this question okay don't forget to make a neat diagram defining your variables and then writing a very clear answer as i want to remind you in all these examples which you are seeing i'm trying to concentrate on which trigonometric ratio should be used okay and how to use Sokatoa, right? Okay, thank you.